Day three of the Christmas album is July 1st. It's Canada Day, and God, does it not feel like July 1st today, Canada Day. This safe haven right now uh, called the piano room slash studio is, and Christmas album is kind of saving me from reality for a second. Uh, piano's been tuned. Um, it's been, <laughs> looks like it's gonna be getting tuned every second day. I'm playing so much, uh, but I'm enjoying it. I'm loving it. Um, today, I'm going to try to record the Christmas song by Nat King Cole. I'm not gonna try, I'm gonna slay it. Um, it's been in my heart and in my fingers, heart for many, 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 many years, and in my fingers for months and months and months. I'm not taking this lightly. Uh, you know, the harmonies, the melodies um, that everybody uh, around the world knows, um, I feel like I've got to honor those uh, for everybody. What I'm trying to do, uh, it's important to note, uh, Nat's song, and I chose, especially with the secular pieces, I, I chose to keep them in their original p uh, keys. Uh, at least the quintessential versions, like Nat King Cole's version is the quintessential version of the Christmas song. Judy Garland's the quintessential version of Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. I, I didn't even mess with those keys. I just kind of just did them in their arrangement. So, and what's cool about the car Carol of the Bells is an A minor. So. Nat's in all black keys and D flat. Carol the Bell's in all white keys, so it actually balances the piano and allows me to have a freshly tuned piano for the day. And we'll see how hard I hit it over the next four hours or so. Peace.